I'm Lieutenant General Todd Seminite, 54 Chief of Engineers, and we're on the road again. Today we're in San Francisco, California at the South Pacific Division Change of Command. With me are two great commanders here who we just had a big change of command. A lot of people came in, distinguished visitors, reception is still going on. With me is Pete Helminger. Pete's done a phenomenal job as a district commander in Europe, went to Afghanistan and commanded, and came in two years ago <clears throat> to be able to lead this great division. And I, I talked at the speech today about all the things you guys are doing, Pete. Your division's really stepped up. The VA program, building the wall, a lot of work for uh, Army and Air Force installations. As you think back on the last couple of years of being in the command right here, what are some of those thoughts that go through your mind? Hey, yeah, sir, I am immensely proud of the South Pacific Division team and all the hard work that they've put in over my two years here in the division. The division has answered every call. The, you met the Mason's toughest challenges here across the Pacific Southwest, clearly delivering for Department of Veterans Affairs, Customs and Border Protection, National Nuclear Security Agency, many other interagency partners, as well as our vital support to 25 Army and Air Force installations across the region. In addition to doing our normal job of delivering the program, we've responded to emergencies across the region, uh, both uh, California wildfires here in Northern California and mudslides uh, down in Santa Barbara. Uh, all this occurred while the other three major hurricanes were going on. I'm very proud that 30% of the SPD workforce deployed in wow. the past year supporting uh, these five different contingencies out there. So I'm just immensely proud of the team and uh, the future I know will be even brighter under under Kim Colleton and the growing workload that we have here with the new uh, federal infrastructure investments, particularly the FY18 supplemental. Uh, we've got a, a large and challenging program here. We're growing our workforce, we're revolutionizing our processes, and the future will be bright with SPD. Well, Pete, there's a lot of the stakeholders at the reception that grabbed me and just said, what a great job you've done out here. And matter of fact, you've done such a great job, we're moving you. And we've got a gap up in the Northwest Division. Pete is driving out of here in about 15 minutes. This is Wednesday, we're gonna be Friday in the Northwest Division, when I'll be giving him the flag of a bigger division with a lot of challenges as well, but you're the right guy to go in. And you talk about the right person, Kim just came in, she is no stranger to this division out here. Four different times, she was here as a captain, he was a district commander, as a lieutenant colonel, a colonel, and now coming back to be the commander of the South Pacific Division. <laughs> So, Kim, you just took that flag. Probably the weight of the world is on your shoulders right now because you are uh, going to lead this great division. But came out of Afghanistan, handpicked to go in there, and we could not be prouder of your performance in Afghanistan. And we're convinced that the hands of the FPD are in uh, uh, exactly in the right place uh, by having you in charge. Kim, what are some of your thoughts? So, sir, thank you very much for the opportunity. And it really is, as we look forward to the future, and I look forward to the future, um, this is an opportunity for me to reflect on the past. And so I started um, here and had a few jobs in the South Pacific Division before, but in New Mexico as the commander there, it was Kit Carson and Lieutenant Fremont, an Army engineer surveyor who traveled from New Mexico out here to discover the Golden Gate, the San Francisco Bay, together and established a lot of the roots in the history of this really rich region that we have a huge responsibility and mission here to do, to deliver. And I'm excited about it. Thanks for the opportunity, sir, and I look forward to Army Strong and Building Strong with you. Well, Kim, we do have a massive workload coming down the road, and this division is postured with great people, great civilians, and great leaders like you to make it happen. So, from San Francisco, we say every day we're Army Strong uh, and the Corps of Engineers, we're Building Strong. But well, we're SBD strong here in San Francisco with a great team, a great outgoing commander, a great incoming commander. Thanks an awful lot. General Seminite on the road again.